हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज धर्मेंद्र मोजित्रा वेलकम टू द गुजराती चेस जोन टुडे आई विल एक्सप्लेन अबाउट द बिशप ओपनिंग पार्ट टू एज यू नो माय फर्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ बिशप ओपनिंग वाज इन गुजराती लैंग्वेज देयर आर सो मेनी वेरिएशंस इन दिस गेम वी हैव लर्न बिफोर अबाउट ब्लैक सेकंड मूव Knight F6. Okay. Other second choice of uh, black is Knight C6 and Bishop C5. So today we will learn about black second move, Knight C6 or B C5. Let's start with second Knight C6. E4, white plays E4, black reply, E5. Bishop C4, as our main move, bishop opening. Last time we have learned about knight F6. Today I will explain about knight C6. Second knight C6. After knight C6, white should play knight C3. simple development b c5 bishop on c5 no worry queen g4 exclamation mark it's a very difficult danger and sharp move after queen g4 black will play here queen f6 or black has second choice d6 so here we have two variation because of threat of queen into g7 so black has two choice queen f6 first let's see queen f6 knight d5 for knight into queen knight into c7 Check. Knight takes rook. Check. So this is a fork. After queen into f2, we are allowing the queen to f2. Force move king d1. No worry about it. After knight f6, white should play. Q captures G7. Here double threat. Queen takes F6 or Queen takes H8. Knight D5. Black try to exchange the pieces. After he takes D5. Bishop f8. Black will try escape from the check. Queen captures h8. Now queen takes d2. Trade queen into h1. No problem. After queen. Queen G2. We will play D into C6. Queen takes H1. Now Queen into E5 check. Bishop E7 and Queen G3 defends your knight. After queen into c6, queen g8 and 10. How? After bishop f8, queen takes check 
and win into half time. So very interesting move, very interesting sacrifice in this game. Let's try what we done after d6 fourth move. If black plays d6, the starting position e4, e5, bishop c4, knight c6. We are learning about second knight c6. White play nc3. Black will play bishop c5. After queen g4, black second choice g6 instead of queen f6. So now, if black plays here g6, white should play queen f3, threatening checkmate. No worry for black, knight f6. Simple development, ng e2. After d6, d3, open up your bishop's diagonal, threatening bishop d5. Black will play bg4. Here, White will play queen g3. After h6, black try to stop this bishop to g5. We have play f4, queen e7, planning for long castle. But after knight e5, fork, knight takes queen. Knight takes c7 and knight into f6. There are family fork. Knight e5. Black force to capture knight e5. And white will take this bishop by queen to capture g4 and stop this castle. Again, knight f6 counter attack. Simple queen s3 and Continue stopping this castling. Knight a5. Black try to exchange the pieces for aggressive attack. Bb5 check. After c6. Bishop a4. Simple defense. B5. And bishop b3, the super variation for white, very good position, aggressive attacking position. Okay, after knight into b3, white will take by this pawn and a file also, white has open file. So, this is the second and c6 variation. Now, let's see second bc5, bishop c5. What should you do against bishop c5? e4, black play e5, bc4, black play bc5, we are second move bc5. You can note down all variation, all moves for your interest and preparation. Now, we will not change our third move, knight c3, as usual. Simple development, queen side development is very fast. Black will play d6. After d3, knight c6, knight a4. Surprising move, white uh, should take this bishop because black bishop is very strong in this position. NGE7, black ignore, knight takes c5, after d takes c5, and simple white f4 for another aggressive attacking move. Now, e takes f4, bishop capture f4, after knight g6, 
Bishop G3. What a super diagonal for white. Bishop G3, see here, is guarding the H4 square also and attack the C7 square also. No worry for white. NCE5, black trying to stop this bishop diagonal and exchange against bishop versus knight. No problem. Bishop b3. White has a two long range bishop here and both bishops are very strong in this position. After bg4, black try to develop his with attack. Knight e2. g5 and queen c1 this also super position for white because white has a very good pawn structure in this game so white should try to exchange the pieces and come into the end game okay so this is very aggressive attacking uh, line for white bishop opening. Let's try if uh, white black plays ng e7 bb6 instead of ng e7 in this line on fifth move. What will you do? Let's start e4 after e5 bishop c4 black play bc5. Then knight c3, d6, d3, and c6, knight a4. Let's see if a black and g e7 does not play here and black played bishop b6. You should simply a3 stop this knight. After nf6, this is only waiting move, not any planning, but long planning, long time planning. nf6, white play any 2 bishop e6, black try to central bishop exchange, and f pawn comes on e6 in the center. After knight into b6, a takes b3, bishop takes e6, f takes e6, short castle, black also castle, ng3 nd7 planning nc5 uh, or q f6 f6 to g6 after bishop e3 q s4 black try to attack on king side C3, see here pawn structure is very strong for white. Knight f6, f3, and in this position, white has a very, very strong position and strong pawn structure, and white can fight very aggressive fight. So, you can try this opening, bishop opening. So my next lesson will upcoming uh, video about uh, French, the king's Indian attack. In my next video, we will see about uh, French defense against French defense. Nice to meet you. I hope we will meet early. Please stay and connected with me. Join and subscribe my channel and like also, if possible, share also. Goodbye.